China is now working on next generation robots. Why do we say that? Because a Chinese company is developing hyper realistic robots that can replicate emotions. Watch this story for more details. Neck length silicone masks lie on a table alongside silicone arms and feet. Disembodied heads sit on display. Humanoid robots in various stages of construction stand nearby and drawings of robot designs adorn a wall. This is a factory in China where robots are built. Ex-robots engineers are working on developing humanoid robots. Their focus is on enhancing facial expressions and emotions. We have our own software and algorithm teams. In terms of algorithms, we focus more on the part of AI that integrates with the robot. There are many basic models and algorithms that are commonly open source, which everyone uses. However, we concentrate more on how to enable the AI to recognize and express expressions and emotions. Look at this. As an ex-robots worker moves her head, smiles and sticks out her tongue, a humanoid robot mimics her movement. This is possible because of the tiny motors installed in several spaces in its head. The model we're making is multimodal and capable of emotional expression. It can perceive the surrounding environment and produce appropriate facial feedback, and the expressions can be generated automatically. According to the company that is building these robots, it takes from two weeks to a month to produce a humanoid robot. Prices for these robots start at $200,000. So far, the main purpose of these hyper-realistic robots has been for display in museums. The company believes in the future, these humanoid robots will have a bigger role to play, not just in healthcare and education, but in other industries as well. Psychological counseling and health are certainly future application scenarios. We are currently conducting related research such as auxiliary treatment and preliminary screening for emotional and psychological disorders. Humanoid robots are believed to be the future of human-machine collaboration. But our question is, will these humanoid robots be able to effectively replicate human capabilities?